Good afternoon, great minds. I want to appreciate God, first of all, for giving me the privilege to be here. I want to thank God also for the life of my upline that brought me into this business called Diamonds Global. I want us to recognize him this afternoon, the person of Michael O.G., a.k.a. O.G. I want us to recognize him. O.G. the billionaire. I praise O.G. because if not for O.G., the testimony that is emanating in my home should have been known avoid. But I want to thank God for the time because we have been fighting for a long time before <laughs> we settled and introduced this product to me. I celebrate you once again, Lord Jim. The Lord bless you. Amen. This product is performing, in fact, God is using this product to perform miracle in my home. I will start with the number one miracle. My husband has been down with prostrate enlargement. And uh, I feel for him whenever he goes to urinate. He stays long in the bathroom before he comes out. And the urine will not come at once. Why is he staying long? Because he's trying to just push everything out. In pain. We tried all sorts to be as if everything is okay later if we are poor. But this, we have been nursing this. Husband has three, three health challenge. He had high blood pressure. He wear glasses. He cannot see without glasses. He cannot read without glasses. So he walk. He live with glasses. And also my elder daughter. So this time around, I went to the seminar. I was supposed to come here and ask him to go. Because Ojo invited me and uh, I was unable, I was unavailable. And I asked him to go for me. So he came here and he was like, wow. Today, what I in fact, it was trying, even a try. So we registered and we got the at Ikeja. I was waiting for Ikeja Rally. Uh, sorry, Ikoto uh, Mega Seminar because we are Ikoto team. So we went there, and that was when I did the registration. I got the product. I get my own back. I asked him to take it. Let us just trust God for this one. And he started taking it. The day one, he took it. Nothing. Day two, day three, he said, Babe, this paper they get. Do I say you don't they go down? As you just continue taking this. Continue taking it. So while he was taking it, he came back to me again, babe. I didn't see far with that glass, so I just realized that I don't even need glass. I've been reading, I just realized it. Then to God be the glory, continue. My husband never since he'll be taking his uh, BP medication, it's just in between, but never normalized. But with this, the big B has normalized. I just want to give you a for the life of the company that put this product together. That is the number one testimony. Number two testimony is the one that blew my mind. I have a friend, a business colleague. He's been complaining about his son. He said his son has been, you know, off and on in the hospital. A 14 year old child. This time around, he landed in a solar intensive care unit, the son. From there, he was referred to Ikeja here, General Hospital. So, this time around, he said it is in Ikeja that the son was diagnosed of leukemia, lympho lymphoplastic acute leukemia. See which one it is. <laughs> the person behind that is handling the, 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 the case is a professor. So I said the only way this be, you know, can be revived is bone marrow transplant in India that costs 
31.5 million. Meanwhile, in the hospital there, this man had been drained. Today, go and buy white blood cell. Tomorrow, go and buy blood. Because the boy has been running out of blood. At this point, the digestive system has been affected because of all the chemicals given to a 14 year old child. He's no longer eating. It's food that they pass through him as food. So what he did was to send a message. I have the boy's picture in my phone. He sent it to me. And they appeal because they're begging people for assistance financially. So they can fly the boy abroad. Okay, they are for the bone marrow plants. When I saw the message, I said, no. Let me see this man. So I went to the cage. You know, I did premium. I three packs, right? So I gave three packs to this man. I took the three packs to him. I said, I smoke good eat into the hospital. I pray with the boy and I told the man, I said, please, doctor must not see this. Give it to him secretly. And let's see what God will do because we prayed. I gave him on Thursday. I tried to tell him Friday, Saturday. They don't not connect him because of the network issues. So on Sunday, around 2 a.m., I saw him online. I chatted with him. I said, How is it? He said, Madam, what you give me, that ever since I started administering this to set, doctors have been surprised. Each time they come for the check, they are amazed. At the rapid recovery of this boy. <laughs> now, Madam, the way I'm saying it, it's like this boy will be discharged this week. Oh. Because he is eating like tomorrow, no day. In fact, he said he's tired, he wants to go home. So, the professor had to run some series of tests on this boy to confirm whether to be discharged or not. Because what they were doing all along was to manage it till they gathered the 31.5 million. And that managing him is taking milking these people. They don't have anything again. They became beggar, begging for money. So after that, I said, Don't worry, go will perfect what he has done. He said it is him, his wife, and his eldest son that knows what is aging the quick response. I said, You should not worry, I go perfect what he has started. So on Thursday morning. I've never seen his wife before. It's only the man I know because he's the one that is my business colleague, you know. So he, she called me. I said, who's this place? She said, I'm so to this boy. She said, praying for me. Thanking me that God has brought me to this family. It's not because of his husband that God brought me to family. That's because of the son. I said, how is set now? He said, as she's talking to me, set has been discharged on Wednesday. Because she called me on Thursday, on that Sunday, that week, that I communicated with Seth's father. So he said they'll be going from home now, from home now for checkup. So we started monitoring, you know, following him up. And the woman said, this boy, the energy this boy has, that she couldn't understand. Because each time they go for checkup, the report is good. He's responding, he's responding. Is responding. I just want to give thanks to the Almighty God. He said, if not God on our side, we won't have no resentment. So many people have died as a result of all those things. After spending money, they died. But this boy case happened when Rosenta is available yes. to go be all the glory. <laughs> now, you know that this boy went for chemotherapy, you know what does now? I too sorry. I too know the worry there. You know this boy is recovering. You still say you want to put him on chemotherapy. I said, okay now. We shall see. So he went for chemotherapy the first time. The second appointment, they postponed. Third appointment, they postponed. Now then they their mouth also the boy running chemotherapy again. She's in the see? She 
different she had to complain of pains, headache at the left eye because she also wear glasses. Like so, we thought it was normal malaria and typhoid. Whenever she's going to school, we give her malaria and malaria and typhoid and other you know uh, pain relief. So she took it and she was still complaining. At the point, she said, "Mommy, I can't take it anymore. Please come and pick me." So I went to school. I brought her home from Benari Public. We went for tests. She was diagnosed with malaria and typhoid, and the, the blood level has. Reduced, so we take up we start treating her. Instead of the 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 the, the, the pains to to subside, still crying, she was, when she couldn't wear her glasses again, and she was supposed to write exam, she could not. I said, no, this is beyond what we are saying here. So I called the optician. He gave us an appointment. I took her to the optician. He checked her and not say that she has inflammation of the eye. This optician just give my picking glass less than six months ago. I wish I'd be having eye broker, you know. I wish I'd be having that kind of problem. Okay, so what do we do? He prescribe, we are going to do that and do this. Okay, how much is it? He gave me the price. The main thing he said so, that she has inflammation of the eye. What came to my mind was, okay. But I just played along with him to hear that I'm in the place. I called my husband. Mama said, if we sent a family to drop glass, that's going to be sent to the machine. That should bring her home. So that is how I told him. We began to give her the center, one part of one part. And only to her. So, the first day, the second day, only the pain has reduced. Don't worry. They had reduced. Third day, fourth day, she began to reduce. So, we call one day, we call one day, we call one day. And today, she's back to school. She has completed her exam today. Because she needs more money, but she has completed it today. I just want to thank the Almighty God. For the company, for Charles Chima, our CSO, and the CEO of Dynes Rose Center, for putting this together. I thank God for the wisdom that has brought to them for putting this together. Please, it works. What I have get is real. Go and get yours.